guys, we found him. Hello everybody, I'm making a tutorial again on how to play Saints Row 1 and possibly even Saints Row 2 if you want to. The Xbox 360 versions on PC, so without any further ado, let's, let's get, get this shit started. started. Okay everybody, so you first get Xenia, the Xbox 360 emulator, click on it or just click download over here and choose the master one, this is the latest version from May 2024 I believe. Then for your copy of Saints Row or any type of game you wish to play as an Xbox 360 exclusive or any kind of game from the 360, I advise you to use your original copy, I know it's harder to get the DVD writer and all that, but I do advise you using it. But as an alternative, we do have Internet Archive. Just search Saints Row Xbox 360 Internet Archive and click the first ring. This is an amazing website. And you just scroll down and the best thing about Internet Archive, as far as I've seen, is that if you click on ISO images, you do have a bunch of versions. For this example, I've downloaded the USA and the world one, which is local and global. Okay, so you just download them. Next, you're gonna go to your download folder. In this case, this is mine. And basically, you get your Xenia Master and just extract it. For example, just, just name it Xenia. Okay, and screw it, this place is okay. It's gonna extract. Now, I'm obsessed with cleaning stuff and uh, making it easier to do. So this is the file and you're gonna click on folder and just name it games. Then you copy your actual games in here as ISO files. Now, I know this is gonna sound a bit tricky, but I already did that and uh, tested the game. So I'm just gonna click my own folder, which I named Xenia Xbox 360. As you can see, I've created this today before making this video to test it. So basically just copy the downloaded ISO files that I already did download and place them in your games folder. So for this, grab your controller, I use the PS5 one, DualSense, run Xenia as an administrator if you want, I don't care at this point. Go to open and choose your desired game, in this case, Saints Row 2021. Yay, it works. Now let's stop the audio because I'm going to get copyrighted by this game because it has all the original music. Sorry, guys. So X, X or A, whatever. It even allows uh, GeForce to stream it, of course. And uh, so uh load i do not have my old saves sadly forgot to make a backup because i finished this game live streaming it was my last my last bunch of live streams on this channel and as you can see this is literally me the same guy he's me i'm him let's begin the game oh yeah man i just love the who got watches guy he's he's my favorite since one meme let's say and bang we did it we finished the game. I'm, I'm joking. And we're in the game. Of course, it runs at a desired frame rate. And uh, there are optimizations for the game, of course, which I'll leave in the description. I'll credit the other mothers who have optimizations. But for the sake of the people who maybe not have such a good hardware and just wish to play Xbox games like Saints Row 1, I just want to make this tutorial short enough. There are fixes for the game, so let's go to the first mission. Just to test if it works. Yeah, the cutscenes are great. Skip them. Skip them. Okay. Now, I'm a pro uh, Saints Row speedrunner, so I'm just gonna jump. And I, I remember that if I want to... Okay, no. Hey. So this has been the tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. More tutorials in the future. Love to the Saints Row community. And I'm helpful, I guess, to you guys if you wanted an updated version. Because a lot of people have been asking me to update my 2021 tutorial on how to play <clears throat> on how to play Xbox uh, version of Saints Row 1, which is the only one. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Consider subscribing. Do all the stuff other YouTubers or content creators are telling you to do. Um, thank you. Have a good one.